Carly Holman Long with Printwear Magazine, and I am here with Ted Van Antwerp of Pennant Sportswear. Uh, Ted, yes. what advice can you offer when decorating fleece? When decorating fleece, we like to see you start with a nice foundation. We offer a beautiful 10 ounce ring spun cotton sweatshirt. Ring spun cotton holds color better than other ways of finishing cotton. Therefore, when you put inking or embroidery on there, your finish, your quality, and your resolution is going to look beautiful when you work with a garment like this. Mark, what advice or tips can you offer when decorating fleece? Fleece, um, really got to look out for the seams. Um, you know, I pulled this, this zip hoodie, and as you can see, besides having just a zipper it going right down the middle of it, you've got pockets, you've got seams everywhere. Seams cause you aggravation. When you go to heat print, if you're printing on a seam, you're not going to get a good flat press, and when you go to launder it, you can start getting some peel. Mm -hmm. So you got to really take into account every, every seam here. When I go to, if I'm going to do something like this, I'm going to wind up using one of these. Okay, it's a, uh, it's a heat pillow. Okay. okay, and what it does, if I have the heat pillow down and I go to heat press it, basically what it does is it's it, it, it recesses the, the zipper into the pillow, giving me a nice flat press, okay? Now, this is, a good, this is a good way to do this style hoodie because this hoodie, this zipper hoodie, has a metal zipper, okay? If this were a plastic zipper, I'd have to do it a little bit different. I'd have to use a print perfect pad. Basically, a print perfect pad is the foam pad material uh, it's a high temperature foam that's used on the heat presses so it can take the heat. Mm -hmm. And what you do is you would stick it in, you would unzip the plastic, the plastic mm -hmm. zipper, stick it up and make sure that the plastic zipper goes over it. So it's not, it's not coming in contact with the heat. That will melt one of the zippers. You also would need a print perfect pad or you could probably pull it off with a pillow, but I would do a print perfect pad, a small one to get the number on the muff pocket. These pockets will create that it create yourself an aggravation because the, you've got a floating head in, in the heat press, it's not gonna get flat. So you've gotta take extra precaution because of all the seams. Ashley, can you offer some advice for decorating fleece? Sure, as you know, Carly, decorating on fleece can sometimes be an absolute nightmare with screen printing. Mm -hmm. So a new and upcoming technology that's really great for fleece is our laser etching. Basically, this creates a really nice tonal effect into the garments and we're literally just burning into the fleece. So you can use a wide variety of colors and it's gonna create a really nice, elegant look for you. I also have another piece I can show you if you just wanna grab this one. So here's a really nice fleece blanket. These are really popular for corporate programs as well as school, so you can do a lot of different stuff with the fleece. It's nice and inexpensive. You can go from low runs to very large runs with the laser etching.